Ladies and gentlemen, today is the day that we're going to see some zombie stuff. The trailer is supposed to be playing at 5 o'clock or something like that. Okay, can we interact with anything? No, still got the two. Open, drop, save, restore. We've only begun to make our way through this maze of secrets. How deep are you willing to go? What paths will you travel? What other commands will you learn and follow? Let's blow this conspiracy up. What the hell was that? Every game has champions. No, no heroes that are on the battle. The fight for glory. We watch and we cheer. We choose sides and pledge our allegiance. What happens when the world sees a trait? What if nothing is right what it seems? That everything you think you know is just a game. A game of wars and lies, cover-ups and disinformation. Secret operations that never took place. Feral pawns grind away their simulation. But every system has its weakness. Join me. It's time to learn truth. Okay, so they're the two new tapes that are on the website pawntakespawn.com. As you can see at pawntakespawn.com. This is all new, right? Oh, wait. The hell is it? Whoa! While some crawl through tunnels and fight through trenches, others dodge bullets in the sky. <laughs> wait, to begin your airborne mission, find the game board in terminals. One of six, following the guideline will aid. Modify boards, column, apply grids. What's by color? What the hell is this? So. Together, Jack Frags, Garlic, Marley, and Noah, and I think someone else, are going to have to work together to unlock the Call of Duty Zombies trailer. That is what I think we have, we're waiting to find out. Oh, shit, what is that? Our... What has he found? Of my thing, but whoever has these colored terminals, there's got to be a puzzle with them where there's a specific... What the fuck, a bat's loaded upon his screen. Thousands of red eyes watch you. Thousands of red eyes okay, watch okay, you. Okay, okay. Yeah, the other one looked like a chessboard. We'll play them side by side. Whoa. Zombie bats? Wait, that's this. Whoa. Board modifiers. That's what. N oh. Garlic okay. needs that. Oh, wait, now they're at the same thing. Yeah, I found that before them. You guys were saying it was old. I told you that was new. Whoa, what the hell's that? Who's is that? Drifter? I think. The hell's on Drifter's no. screen? Make sure. Okay, so I have all three of Dude, should we put in everyone's? Watch this. I am the master behind all of this! Okay. Think of it! Think of yourselves! Alright, who do you think is gonna crack the code first, ladies and gentlemen? Okay, calm it down. Alright, listen, we've gotta be responsible adults. Stop it. Alright, so we haven't got anywhere yet. Guys, this is your this is your Call of Duty Zombies waiting room, okay? We're here to entertain you. Imagine if the code was fog. <laughs> so, in summary of all those like codes that was not a QR code, it turns out you're supposed to readjust them, and once you've reorganized them, it spells slash dust off. Okay? Basically, you go to pawn takes pawn again, and you do slash dust off this time, which takes you to this page, excuse me, that they're all looking at. Now, I need to disappear again for you to be able to see it. But if you look here, there. Airborne jump orders, scanner stacks reveals re uh, run of your point, whereas if heli count indicates pilot manual page, heli latitude uh, positioning direct indicator order jump direction, white helicopters jump twice, yellow helicopters jump three times, mission score indicates their index. So now, using this image, it's gonna give you a bunch more information. So, if you're wondering what's happening now, ladies and gentlemen, these people are taking screenshot coordinates to work out which tile they're on to work out which number they're on, to work out the next step of the code. It is even getting more complicated. 2,000 years later. Ladies and gentlemen, we have progress. We have progress. Shout out to Geeky Pastimes. Bonus stage unlocked. Bonus stage unlocked. Is that it? I'm in! Yep. I beat him. Bonus stage unlocked. Explore Zork now to secure the keys. Return at 12pm tomorrow to unlock the next step. No. No. I've got a flu. This can't be right. 
This can't be right. I've been here for two hours. Where's my trailer? This is all leading towards the zombies reveal. This is pretty nuts, but I don't want you guys to say that this was a disappointment or like this was a waste of time because it wasn't. It was. They're just really, really hiding um, a ton of Easter egg stuff behind this yeah in a non-entertaining way of zombies if we could do it in the other games or something like that then i'd completely understand but the fact that we just spent two hours watching people struggle okay not these guys they had loads of people there helping them out and stuff like that but the fact that we just spent two hours watching people struggle to understand that it was going to be the zombies reveal and these guys who are official cod partners saying that Today was going to be the zombie reveal. Like, look at these guys' titles. Zombie reveal. Zombies reveal. Like, this was not a zombies reveal. I, I, I am so disappointed in what we've just watched and what we've just seen. Like, I hope that this doesn't lead into the direction they've gone with zombies, the actual game. And I'm not being mean when I say that in the slightest. but. I'm going to be pissed if they think in any way in this like sneaky de -de 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 this, this is what we want to do with zombies moving forward. I have said time and time again, like, try out, please, try out, please, try out, please, 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 please. Just make the zombies fun. Yeah, there'd be an Easter egg that, you know, the Easter egg guys can do because that is what zombies is all about. Absolutely. But like, don't make us jump through a million and six hoops just to have fun to play the game. And it's one of those, like, people are so excited for this. Like, they gave us a, a teaser trailer of four, the 14 seconds they gave us, or whatever it was, was one million times, one million percent more entertaining than what I've just watched. Any of it. Any of the breaking down, any of the this. And if that is a sign or indication of the amount of effort or work that's going to be having to go through for the Easter eggs in the actual game, bro, count me out. Count me out. I do not want to jump into zombies to try and solve an Easter egg or something like that. I love running around finding the radios and shit like that. Like a little five-year-old who has no idea about main storyline Easter eggs. I don't care about them. I love knowing about the zombie storyline. I like killing zombies with epic fucking guns on cool-ass maps that get more and more interesting as the game develops. That is it. That is it. So... To say I'm disappointed is an understatement. I know, like, the hype is there for it, and they know that. But they've put the zombies on the pedestal. And they've put it too high up to the point where people are now left with a bit of taste in their mouth. The community, even like Dalek then, was being like, oh, no, don't, don't say it was a waste of time. Don't say it was a disappointment. It was a waste of time, and it was a disappointment. The game may be epic. It may not even be stressful at all in the slightest like this. But doing this to your community that's so badly wanting to support your game is just a no, no, no in my direction. In my, in my book, sorry. Like, that, it, just a no. So, I, I, I honestly, I am so sorry to everyone who tuned into my stream for two hours expecting uh, a trailer. Because I was expecting a trailer. I think the entire community was expecting a trailer. And lo and behold... This is what we got left with. So I think the really only good thing that came out of today's stream was the fact that I gave away two copies of uh, Call of Duty Cold War for your guys' faces. I appreciate the support. And I'm just pretty good. I'm just pretty good. That's all I'm going to say. I expected a lot more. I'm not going to like start slamming trap. Like, they're, they're over. Cancel them sort of thing like people do nowadays. I'm just saying... I'm just disappointed, and I hope they learn from this. Because when Dalek then just said they're like they're gonna really make us work for it, there's so much you know like time and all this. That makes me think with how Dalek was speaking that either one he's already seen the zombies, like because these guys do see the things prior to it, like multiplayer guys do. Zombies back in the day, we used to see it back early on and stuff like that. Which makes me think like I am so hoping they do not know the, the you know like the the sort of storyline of how the trailer's going to get revealed and all that sort of stuff on gameplay. And it just worries me. So, yeah. The fact that he was defending it, defending him that much makes me a bit like, yikes, dog. Because that was a disappointment. 
And even if he is a COD partner, he's very much entitled to his own opinion still. So he's not slamming him, he's just going to be like, damn, that took too long, you know, for such a little reward. If that would have led us then <coughs> to a trailer, no one would be complaining right now. But the fact that we have to wait until tomorrow when people have been waiting like, I don't know, like, like a week already for this, is just a, that's a big F, bro. That is a big F. But guys, I want to thank you very much for watching. If you are watching this on YouTube, leave a like, crane, click that subscribe button. And uh, yeah, I will see you guys um, maybe tomorrow for another stream reaction, another thing of the trailer coming out. Who knows? Let's hope it actually comes out tomorrow, but I have no idea. I just have no idea if we can even say that because we don't even know if it is going to come out tomorrow or not. So if it does, it doesn't, whatever. Twitch.tv for slash syndicate, links in the description. At five o'clock, I'll be there streaming and uh, we'll see what happens. And hopefully I'll make it as entertaining as possible for you guys. But until then, much love. Thanks.